This ain't gonna take long. Did with tobacco, sweet Jane. Hey, right now, okay, and this is Cigar Vlog. Alright, so this is obviously a cigarillo. Means itty bitty little cigar. And Dead with Tobacco, as far as I know, is actually an offshoot of Dura State. So, just like the Dura State Acid line, this is an infused cigar. And yes, it is an actual cigar. It is hand rolled, 100% tobacco. It has kind of a strange cap if the camera will stop focusing on the damn grass. But as you can see, yes, it is 100% hand rolled. But because it is an infused cigar, you want to be real careful about how you store these. Because any kind of Dura State infusion cigar is going to fumigate everything else in your box. And basically make everything taste exactly the same. So like I said, real cigar, real tiny. You still need to trim the cap. Or what classifies as a cap. So far my experience with these is that you have to be kind of careful because they like to unravel. Isn't this adorable? Good lord, man, it's like sh it's a sugar bomb. Jesus Christ. Okay, so right off the bat, stupidly sweet. Oh my god, that is sweet. Sweet. It's kind of a cinnamony note in the actual aroma. Overall, sweet, cocoa y, kind of vanilla ice cream. So, every one of these I've had has been basically like smoking an ice cream sundae. I just sticks to your lips. <laughs> yeah. Be careful where you smoke these because you're going to be mm, 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 doing that a lot. Versus always smoking on a bicycle. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and fix the light. Get down to, well, I would say the first inch, but there's not really a whole lot to go on here. Uh, get this down to mm, what looks like a good start and give an update from there. Well, I didn't quite make it to the tunnel. <laughs> so far. Flavors from start to this point have been straight up ice cream sundae. Get a little vanilla, a lot of sweet, a bit of cocoa. Occasionally the aroma has a little bit of a tobacco smell, but mostly kind of a cinnamony note. It's to say, when they call it Sweet Jane, they are not kidding. It is super duper sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweetie, sweet. But aside from the sugar bomb ice cream sundae, what does the tobacco taste like? Like if I know. <laughs> I literally cannot taste anything other than that stupidly sweet, over the top, just vanilla ice cream, chocolate sauce, just straight up ice cream sundae. <sighs> anyway, I'm gonna see if I can get through the uh, other end of the tunnel here before I get to the halfway point and get an update from there. Okay, I think it's about the halfway point so far. Not really any change in the flavors. Everything's still ridiculously sweet. Still smoking an ice cream sundae. <laughs> as far as what you would pair this with, a milkshake, maybe, a candy bar. Not gonna lie, at the end of the day, this thing is a novelty. This is basically what you buy for your college buddy that uh, wants to pretend he's a badass. So you buy him a cigar, except you buy him one of these because he can't handle an actual cigar without barfing his guts up. Uh, not because of the nicotine bomb, but because he just like, you know, decided to pour through half a crate of Everclear before showing up for the party. Anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna get this down to the dub. There's always somebody with a stupidly loud vehicle. I'm gonna get this down to the nub and uh, see if anything dies down or if the actual tobacco flavor comes through. So far, doesn't seem likely. Okay, make sure I'm actually recording. <laughs> All right, so I got down to the nub. As you get towards the end of this thing, uh, it really, you don't even notice the infusion anymore because it really just washes out. The only thing it tastes like is hot tobacco. 
Also, uh, just a quick side note here. Do not smoke these indoors or in a car. These things just dump foot smoke like crazy bad all the time. I mean, I've had incense burning that doesn't release this amount of smoke. Really freaking weird. But I guess that, uh, given the flavor profile of this, that's probably just all the oils they infuse it with just going completely bananas. <laughs> anyway, like I said, you don't actually notice the tobacco flavors until all you get is hot tobacco. Everything else is just this cloyingly sweet um, ice cream sundae flavor. That might be your thing, but like I said, it's a novelty. They probably shouldn't be selling these in actual tobacco shops. They should, sell, they, they should probably sell these in like candy stores, you know? Like you get your kid like a baseball sized jawbreaker so they keep them busy for the next three days. And then ask behind the counter to get, get a pack of these for yourself. And then, you know, try not to go into a diabetic coma from the sugar buzz. <laughs> Is it worth a little pack of cigarette deals? Yeah. Would I recommend getting them in anything bigger? No. I mean, especially do not get like a full-size Gordo or anything like that because, oh God, mm. Well, anyway, not much else to say other than sweet, sweet, sweetie, sweet. Total novelty. If you're bored, give them a shot. If not, mm, find something else, like literally anything else. <laughs> They're good for a laugh and that's pretty much it. Anywho, not much else to say. Better than uh, Sugar Bomb. So, like I said, there's not much else to say about this other than the fact that it is just so freaking sweet. Anyway, if you like this review or any other review, like, subscribe, leave a comment, let me know if you had a different experience. Or if you have found a cigarette that's infused like this that maybe isn't quite so right your teeth out sweet. <laughs> Beyond that, check out my Twitch stream Sunday to Friday night, 10 p.m. to 2 a.m. If you can't make it live, it will be on, the, on YouTube eventually. Yeah, of course it's going to be on the internet because it's already on the internet, derp. Anyway, <laughs> that's all I got for this one. I'll see you next time.